What is up guys, I am JKU390, and after I made my last walkthrough on how to get all of the achievements on the level Metropolis, I realized I actually had fun making guides. So fellow True Friends Gaming member Upside Down Grunt and myself spent a couple of hours during our evening to show some of the other achievements we can get just in a private server on Halo Master Chief Collection. On today's video you can actually do this by yourself, but we both needed it anyway, so we just kind of filmed it together. But it's going to be Brain Pan, which is to find all the six hidden skulls in the Halo 3 multiplayer maps. Luckily, they're in the last six maps that were released, so if you go to the level select, just scroll to the very end and it's the last six. Also, if you start and quit two more Halo 3 maps after that, it'll unlock another achievement, which is the World Traveler. So that will give you another extra 10 to cheat or gamer score, which will bring you to a total of about 50 from this video. Let's begin. So the first thing I want to say is you want to be in Forge for all of these. The first map we're going to is Assembly. I know I'm going through these pretty quickly. But it's just right up here on one of the center coils that's in the middle of the map. Boop -a -doop. And all you have to do is fly up there and grab it. I'm not really sure on which side it was on. I kind of flew around it. I just was lucky enough to spawn by it. Matt still isn't even there, but there he is. Next map we're going to is Orbital. Now you have to walk down and go to where the Death Pit is, which is down here, where you can actually fall into space. And then you want to go into the monitor mode and just fly to the very top of it. And on the shorter side, so the, the one that sounds high, obviously, that's what short means, um, you go up, and there's the skull. You just drop down, grab it, and you will get another achievement worth 5 gamer score. Then we're going to Sandbox. Now, what you want to do here is use the sun as your guide, and there's going to be two pillars, one directly to the right, and then the one further to the right. Just go to the center of the first two. Now, usually there's mines that, like, shoot up at you. I remember in the original Halo 3, we had to get in forge mode and make a tunnel system to get there. Um, but for some reason the mines weren't shooting us, so either they're just not on in Forge anymore, in Master Chief Collection, or there was just a weird glitch. If they do shoot mines up at you, just make a platform or use tunnels and fly that way while inside of it. Boop -a -doop. Lay it down, pick up the skull, and then you will have the sandbox skull. Then of course I had to give it to Matt, who was throwing grenades because we were confused why there weren't explosions going off. Next map is Citadel. You're gonna have to go to the blue side, or the darker colored side, go past the overshield, and then just right up here in this ledge. I started at the ramp in the center, if that helps you guys on where I went. And there's the achievement. So I looked back at the overshield to give you guys the basic idea. Then I had to wait for Matt to get there so I could give him the skull. There he was. Who I saw had a rocket launcher, so I knew what he had planned. So I shot him there at the end. And then Heretic. This is one of the quickest ones. I just happened to spawn, like, looking at it. All you have to do is right by, I guess, perpendicular to the sword spawns, like right there. There are two tunnels, and on top of one of them is the skull. Boop -a -doop. And then finally, the last map that we will be visiting after I give Matt the skull is Longshore, which is actually one of my favorite Halo 3 maps. Uh, just right here, I spawn there again, right by the vent system. At first, I was like, uh, I think it was up here, but then I was like, oh, wait, no, it's lower. Right here was me looking for it, and then I was like, oh, wait, no, it's at the bottom of it. So then I flew around there and grabbed it. It's been a while since I've gotten these on the original Halo 3. But that is all of the skulls on Halo 3. Uh, I guess it was the Mythic map pack, but it's not anymore now. It's just part of Master Chief Collection. Hopefully that helped you out. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. And you'll probably see more of these. Hopefully better organized where it's not me just talking in post and hoping I get everything timed right. So I've been JKU390. That guy's upside down grunt. And until next time, guys, later.